Well, do you remember on uh, Saturday, I guess it was, when we were talking about the Raw lineup and uh, talking about how they're going to do all eight of these matches on Raw? Yeah, they only did six. And I said, how are they going to do this? Well, they figured out that's what they were going to do. The answer the was thing. they couldn't. Yeah, they did six, and they got two two of the matches. It will be Ray and Kofi Kingston and Shayna Baszler and Selena Vega will be at the house shows. You know what's house funny? House shows. They did not mention which night they were on. No. Or what show. It's like, if you're going to do them on house shows, shouldn't you go, oh, by the way, we're going to be in, you know, I don't. I haven't even looked up what cities there are this week, this week. But let's just, you know, you know, yeah, this match is going to be in Binghamton, New York. Why, why did they, why would you not say that? I don't know, man, but like, I don't know why they indicated all of them would be taking place on Raw on the pay-per-view. I mean, well, maybe they, they did thought they about... try and then realize we can't actually do this unless we give all these matches like eight minutes and we actually or, want to give them less. more time. I, I'm sure that's what happened. But then to not only, and then not only that, it's like, okay, fine. You're, you're putting some of them on a house show. Like, okay, that's cool. Like, if you're going to put them on a house show and film it, put on television... Go, hey, you should n- never miss a house show. Big shit happens on a house show. Or, hey, we're coming to this town. You're going to see this tournament match that we're going to film for TV. You sell some tickets. Nothing. 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 They, never, they never promoted where it was, They will just be was. on a house show this weekend. Yeah. And the show still went a minute over, despite all of that. Yeah. But uh, I would say the first 90 minutes of the show were very good. The last 20 minutes with Gunther and Sheamus... That was, was really good. Yeah. But uh, the hour prior to that sucked. Kofi did a Mich- promo. Michinoku Mich- 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 driver, actually. And she Mich- said Mich- that uh, Kofi says, Woods, I don't know when he's going to be back. I need to beat Gunther, get to the next round. But to beat, I guess to get to Gunther, I got to beat Rey Mysterio. All time great, he says. And he vows to win the tournament for Xavier Woods. He doesn't mention where the match is or nothing. Nothing. No. Nothing. Yeah. Just that they're having a match. You know, for all of the thing, you know, I mean, it's like when it was first announced at the at the start of the show that they were doing these matches at house shows, I thought, this is a good idea. I, I still think it's a good idea. But this is like, this execution, if this was AEW, people would just be talking about how absolutely incompetent they were by announcing it and then not telling you what Well, I am here telling you how absolutely incompetent WWE was for having two matches at a house show, not I telling thought, us who, what, when, where, why. I guess we know who. Okay, well, here's the, that's, like, like, I thought, this is a good idea, you know, like, give some, make the house shows mean something, and then they don't tell you. I mean, it was like, what, what? I, Luckily, is- I will fly to every house show, and I'll <laughs> catch it one way or the other, because I really want to see these matches. Yeah, Shayna Baszler and Zelina, yeah. Hey, you know what was really fun, by the way, Dave? What? At WWE Speed Tournament. Did mm-hmm. you watch any of it? No, I watched none of it. I watched the entire tournament 18 minutes today, because mm-hmm. they're all three-minute matches, and uh, it was actually really fun to watch them all in order, because, yeah. you know, the first match was Ricochet and, and Dragon Lee, and they went, uh, I think they had like 10 seconds left for the finish of that match. Dude, you should have seen these guys sprinting. Mm-hmm. They sprinted for two minutes and 50 seconds. They had to be exhausted at the end of this match. And uh, it was a lot of fun. People haven't seen it. If you want to go up there and check it out on X. So the main event here was Gunther and Sheamus. And, uh, yes, we had another banger here. And, uh, Ch- God, Sheamus' chest is just, like, practically bleeding. It just looks it was bleeding. bruised and bloody and just... I mean, it was it, it was it was messed up like in the first minute of the match. Yeah, they chopped the hell out of each other. They worked over uh, his neck, his bad neck. Uh, Gunther worked over his knee. The knee, yeah. Yep. And finally, uh, they start doing all the near falls, the jumping knee, the brogue kick. The ref is uh, frantically telling them they're overtime. Kaiser uh, Kaiser interfered a couple times. He and interfered. Got yeah. Out. yeah, he got booted out too. Went after the knee. They booted him out. Gunther countered into a crab. Sheamus tries to get the ropes. Gunther pulls him back to the middle, and Sheamus taps out. I was so, surprised about that tap out finish. Well, you know they had to do something. They were they were out of time. That yeah. was it. So, but yes, it was an excellent main event. I do hope they have a fourth, maybe on pay per view again. Get some uh, get some real time in. But yeah. this was an excellent. They had match. real time. They had twenty one minutes. Well, yeah, but I mean, I had to sit through. Uh, you know, there eight of that th- was commercials. 
Yeah, they did go. Yeah, that's true. Two commercial breaks they had in that match. So, yeah, it's for the king and queen of the ring. We have got, uh, actually, next week's Raw, we got Ilya Dragunov, Jey Uso, Gunther versus whoever wins the Dallas show between Kofi and Ray. So, Lyra. so, so for Ilya to wrestle Gunther, he's got to beat Jey Uso. I yeah. don't know. He's going. I don't know. That he's going to do that. We'll find out. We'll find out. If well, Jey Drew, Uso's not, if he's not winning the tournament, yeah, they, he can lose to Ilya Dragunov. Well, I mean, if he, he is lose, winning the tournament, he ain't going to lose. He ain't going to lose clean. I mean, he could lose with like Drew McIntyre costing him or something like that. But yes, he ain't going to lose or, or Priest or some or Judgment Day or something. But you know, they're not going to have Jey Uso lose clean. He's the number one babyface on the brand. Well, I guess Punk is technically, but Punk's not wrestling yet. So we've also got uh, Lyra versus Zoe and Io Sky versus either Sh- uh, Shayna or Zelina, whoever wins at this uh, Random House show. Yeah. And then uh, for the King and Queen of the Ring, Becky versus Liv Morgan for the women's title, Sammy Bronson and Chad, and the finals of both of those tournaments. So also, they did not give a SmackDown bracket. No. They're probably figuring that out. That would be another one where people would be, if it was AW, where people would be just going, how incompetent they are. They they should have had not a even bracket. Had a, they should have had what? They should have bracket and told us what matches. Actually, they may on. have had the bracket, but I don't know if they told us what. Uh, I didn't see a bracket. I would have. I don't think they did. A, I mean, unless I fast forwarded through it, which and, which, and I, I didn't. You know, I don't think they had a SmackDown bracket. Let me. Uh, no, we got a bracket. Oh, there is a SmackDown bracket? Okay. Yes. Okay, so this is the uh, this is the full bracket. We've got AJ Styles versus Randy Orton. Baron Corbin versus Carmelo AJ Hayes. And, AJ and Randy Orton? Ooh, yeah. That's, that's really big. AJ and Randy Orton. Carmelo Hayes and uh, Baron where, Corbin. Where, where, what in the show, where, where in the show was that? I don't know, but I got it right here in front of me. Okay, all right. LA Knight versus Santos Escobar. And Lashley versus Tonga. Tonga is in the tournament. Tama mm-hmm. Tonga. So uh, they did not, however, announce which matches were going to air on SmackDown. I do not believe. Mm. Uh, or maybe actually it was on Raw Talk they announced it. That's why you didn't see it. Okay. Well, that would make sense. What yeah. about the women's side? Uh, the women's side. Let's see. Shouldn't that have been announced on television? I don't know if we have the women's side. I've only got the men's side right here. Okay. Yeah, there's a full bracket for King of the Ring. Okay. So I guess got to wait for the full bracket for. Uh... Did they announce on Raw? Oh no! Here we go. No, no, we don't have it. Okay. I don't think. Queen of the Ring tournament. Yeah, Queen of the Ring tournament is still all question marks. Okay. As far as I know. Brian, you sound like the guy I'm talking about on this match tonight. Yeah. Miz. Oh stop! Oh. <laughs> God. His... Huge pop. Granted, you know Miz is Brian's favorite wrestler. <laughs> Braggers tonight's. Start over. Start over. Braggers. Braggers Knights. Knights? After a few brags by Miz. A few brags? (laughs) That's what I said. Okay. The match started with body hugged tugs. (laughs) Body tugs? (laughs) Whoa. (laughs) What the hell show is this? That's where you put your arm around the middle and tag. Trying to tag him around. Tug? You reach around from behind. <laughs> and tug? Brian, stop. Okay. Miz jumps out of the ring to slow down his uh, hurting. <laughs> <laughs> if you're going to tear this apart, I'm not going to read it. <laughs> no, please, please keep reading it. Hey, guys, did you love this clip? If so, you should join our channel. Just hit the join button and you'll have full access to every single show that we do. Wrestling Observer Live, Wrestling Observer Radio, The Brian and Vinny Show. All of them in full HD, full length, plus archives of all of your favorite shows. Click join today and don't miss out.